Mm -hmm. uh, but the main thing that's happening on this project, rather than trying to reinvent their kitchen, was work with what they had, add to it, make it more luxurious, but mainly function. give them more space and function. Mm -hmm. So trying to keep the kitchen functioning as long as possible. Yeah, she can still use it, huh? Just not the sink. Right. <laughs> yeah, so, so we were able to do that. I mean, when these walls were up, we built all of this and kept it functioning as long as possible. But now because of sheetrock and scraping textures on existing and putting in lights and so forth, now it had to be opened up mm -hmm. so that we can run everything together. But, but you're it, still not part of the whole house. Right. Two new dust walls. Two dust walls, exactly. And, a door. and so that, that's pretty cool. That's um, really minimized the downtime on this project, even though it's a large construction. I mean, we're in a big area now, mm -hmm. and then the big patio that's attached to it. So a lot of work has been done here, but very little interruption with the client. Little impact. I want to comment on another thing about this project is it shows our flexibility. As you see here, we took down some cabinets. And we're actually, we're, gonna, we're actually going to be reusing those. Mm -hmm. And that is just, you know, trying to match what's here, not over, over uh, you know, exaggerate what, the, what they want on their, pro in their house. We want to build to your budget. So we're matching windows, we're matching a lot of the features. Of course, some of the things are being upgraded, but the main thing that's happening on this project, rather than trying to reinvent their kitchen, was work with what they had, add to it, make it more luxurious, but mainly function. give them more space and function. Mm -hmm. Is that what you were saying, function? Yeah, function, because we're gonna give them two cooktops, two stoves and ovens, because she has a lot of family and, and grandkids, I believe, and they like to do cooking. So yeah. that was a big thing. So this is going to be able to get extended along this wall. Right. So the, the cabinets the cabinet come this way. And then this room is now part of the kitchen. Yep. And the room adjacent through here will also feel like it's part of it, which before was the only thing they had on. And it's, and it's too small for the types of gatherings she wants. Mm -hmm. I got to say, I never thought this project would be as big as it turned out to be. I know. Uh, but she knows she was going to stay here. She knew it. Yep. And she knows what she wants. And this is what she wants for her home. She loved her home. Yeah. She but, loves where she lives. Yeah, and so it doesn't matter where you live, you can get what you want in your home, even if it's a small home, even if it's a big home and you want a little bigger, or you just want to repurpose the space. This is a really good example of flexible design, working with what we have and not, not having to completely change it. Mm -hmm. We don't need to throw away what's good. Mm -hmm. we, we just work and get you the things that you're lacking right now. So I like this project for that reason. I, th I think it's a really good example of flexibility. Yeah. And it's going to look awesome to come. Yeah, wait till you see it when it's done. <laughs>